everyone and welcome to my channel my name is crystal if you are new here and on this channel i talk about all things fashion beauty and lifestyle so today i have an h&m haul if you visited my channel before then you know i love h&m and i love zara and i'm always doing a zara and an h&m haul so um today is no different um i just picked up a few pieces a lot of cozy pieces because you know we're coming into the you know the winter time where we just want to be nice and comfy and cozy so i have a few pieces i have like three coats to show you guys um some layering pieces um, I have like a variety of items here is basically what I'm trying to say so um, yeah so but before I get into the H&M haul I just wanted to real quick um, share with you guys a few jewelry items or jewelry pieces that I just recently got from Anna Luisa jewelry um, if you follow me before then you know I've spoke about this brand before and so I just wanted to mention um, the brand again um, so I just wanted to show a few pieces that I um, recently picked up. So the first item is this um, like gold ring. It's such a pretty ring. And um, I wanted something like this or I've been wanting something like this for a while. And I saw that they had it on Anna Luisa and I just had to pick it up. Um, all these pieces, all of Anna Luisa jewelry, they are a very sustainable brand. So all their pieces are made of recycled material and they are tarnish free. So I've uh, picked up my other items that I've gotten before from them have, you know, held up pretty well. No tarnishing or anything. So yeah, it's just good pieces to have in your collection. Um, and I also got this um, necklace here. It says Mama and it's a good, I think this is a good layering piece. I'll try to show you guys like close ups of these items or these pieces a little bit better than what you can see here and then I also got these huge like chunky um, hoop earrings I've been wanting some more hoop earrings that are just a little bit more chunky so they have these on the site and I just had to get these so I love all three of these pieces again they're very um, just very everyday pieces they um, are definitely pieces that would I think would make good Christmas gifts um, as a matter of fact they are having a Black Friday still going on now until the 23rd so if you're looking for you know um, pieces or any kind of gift um, if you haven't you know gone done your Christmas shopping and you're trying to think you know what can I get you know those you know loved ones in my life um, especially like moms I think this would be a cute one for if you have like a mom um, who's into jewelry or if you are a mom and you're into jewelry because that's why I got this one because I am a mama and you know because it says mama so you know why not let people know that I'm a mama I don't know but no I just thought it was really cute and very you know dainty and just delicate and yeah so I had to pick it up for myself but if you're looking for you know a nice gift for your mom or you know your sister or whoever whoever that special woman is in your life I think this will be a cute piece to get them so yeah, so they are having, like I said, a Black Friday sale going on right now. Um, all their pieces are anywhere from $39 and up. So very affordable, you know, if you are on a budget. Um, I will leave the link down below if you want to check them out or check some of the other pieces out. Um, besides the one that I've shown you guys today, um, I will leave the link down below. So just be sure to check them out because it is a good, sustainable brand. And like I said, tarnish free and just good. Uh, I feel like good Christmas gifts so yeah so um, now we're gonna get into the items that I picked up from H&M all right and this first item I got is this um, gray like uh, sweater dress and I've been wanting to get a gray one for a while I have several other colors and I don't have any gray sweater dresses um, like this so I saw that they had them on H&M and I got this in a size large and I would say this is true to size I'm typically just for reference like a size um, 8 in dresses or like a medium so this just I mean it just fits like it's not too big and it's not like too small or too tight so I would say if you are interested in this dress if it's still available because y'all know how H&M they like sell out quickly um, so if it is still available I will link it but if you are able to get your hands on it I would say you know sizing up would be okay because y'all know how it is with these H&M sizes like you don't know if you need it you don't know what size you're gonna get you know or what 
the fit is going to get in, you know, whichever size that you get. So I would say to size up if you want it to be a little bit more loose fitting, but not, it's not too big, you know, as you can see from the um, try on clip. Yeah, but it's just a gray um, turtle or not turtleneck. I don't know. It's not a turtleneck quite, you know, um, but it is a nice. Uh, very cozy it's not I tried it on and it's not itchy at all because you know how some uh, fabrics as far as sweater material can be very itchy and scratchy this is not at all it's very comfortable and um, yeah I think you can get a lot of wear out of it so um, that's the next piece or that's the first piece that I picked up from H&M alright and this is the next piece that I got and it's just um, this cardigan and I got this in a size large and it is oversized so um, I already sized up because I wanted it to kind of fit, you know, an oversized kind of a fit. But I would say that if you want it to not be too big, because as you can see from the, the try-on uh, portion, it's very long in my arms. And I have long arms, so that says a lot. Um, and, and I don't know, I forgot to mention in that gray sweater dress, the arms are a little bit short on me with that, with that dress. So just kind of keep that in mind. It's not very long on the arms if you have long arms, which I do. Um, but this one, it, it definitely goes past my wrist and is very long on me. Um, but yeah, it is very oversized. And another thing about this piece, I will say is that it, it sheds like, it sheds like bad hair weave. I mean, it is a shedder, okay? And so I don't know how I feel about that. It doesn't have the price on here, but I'm pretty sure this was uh, pretty expensive um, for H&M anyway. But it's made out of wool. It's a wool alpaca blend. So I've heard those kind of fabrics can tend to shed um, or any kind of blend of fabrics, I think, tends to shed. So I don't know. You guys let me know. Um if I should keep this or not or get rid of it I been trying to look at different hacks as far as how you can get rid of or you know the shedding the excess shedding and I read that you know you need to wash it and then I read that you need to freeze it and I don't know this is just too high maintenance for me um, so I don't know I, I may keep it and see if I can you know try those different hacks that I saw but you guys let me know down below if those hacks work if you bought sweaters or any kind of um, clothing that sheds and you tried those hacks let me know if they work because yeah I this was not this was not affordable like it was pretty much I think I remember I think it was like $59 I'm not sure um, but they also had this in a different color. I think like, um, this kind of color, I think they had it in, um, like an oat milly kind of beige color. So I don't know. You guys let me know what, what you think or what you think I should do. It is a nice sweater though. It is a very nice, uh, uh cardigan and it has these cute, um, like tortoise shell buttons. So I don't know. Y'all let me know what I need to do about that cardigan because. Yeah, I'm not about having clothing that's high maintenance, but, you know. Alright, and the next item I got are these jeans, and they're just like, um, I think they're called the Loose Mom Jeans, and I got these in a US 10. Um, I tend to try to go up on jeans, or size up on my jeans, because I do have a big butt, and I uh, have hips, you know, so... I, that's I've been really into the mom jeans here lately, um, but they look, they look like this just in like this light wash And I don't know if you can tell on camera, but it has like this um, I don't know what you call this like a Gosh, what do you call it like a pleating down the middle? I guess you can call that a pleating I guess down the middle and Yeah, I love the wash on it even though it's kind of more like a summertime wash, but I didn't have any mom jeans like this so I just thought I would take, you know, a chance. I don't think I've ever ordered any jeans from H&M. Um, so I just thought I'd try them out. And they do fit um, kind of, they fit kind of snug. So I don't know if I should maybe go up one more size just so they'll fit, you know, um, a little bit more loose and more comfortable. But they are comfortable considering that, you know, even though they are a little snug, they still are, you know, pretty comfortable. I just couldn't you know, eat Thanksgiving meal with these jeans on. So, yeah, they won't be something I'll be wearing for Thanksgiving, that's for sure. Um, but they are nice. They like they seem like they're a nice quality jean. And they are, they are a little bit stretchy, too, when they're high-waisted. So, 
and they go down to my ankles which I love because I'm five seven and it's hard to find jeans that'll go down to your ankles so but yeah so I got those jeans and yeah I love those so I'm just still trying to decide if I'm gonna um exchange them for um a larger size so but yeah so got those all right and the next item I got I actually got it in two colors I love layering in the in the winter time well the fall too but I think most of my layering I pretty much do in the uh, winter time so I wanted some more layering pieces that were not just like you know your basic black or white or cream or gray I wanted like something colorful so I got this like turtleneck yeah it's like a turtleneck kind of a um, top and it's very thin so like I said it's it's a layering piece so if you wear this by you know without anything with it you know you'll probably freeze to death in the winter time so um, I bought this to layer with like vests as I just purchased a lot of like sweater vests um, to like go under like you know dresses you know just another like I said a layering piece so it's just like in this pinky I don't know the camera is making it more brighter than it is but it's like in this mobby pink kind of a color and so yeah and I got this in a size large so it I would say it's a little bit oversized and I purchased it oversized um, because I'm a medium typically like I said so this fits a little big on me so that's fine because I don't want anything too tight that's why you know or too fitting I wanted something a little oversized especially if you are layering so but yeah so I got it in this pink color and I also got it in like this green I don't know what color green this is it's definitely lighter on screen but it's like a I don't know what kind of green it's like a maybe like a hunter green it's not sage yeah it's like maybe a hunter green so I love this color I've been loving green here lately I've purchased a lot of green items I don't know why I like sage green I like this color green I don't know I've been loving green so yeah the same top or the same turtleneck that I just showed you is just in this green so yeah so got that and I also got it in a size large and the next two pieces is actually a set and I was really excited about these because I don't believe it or not I don't have any like satiny type of pajamas as far as like pants goes and so I was browsing H&M like you know you normally do and I found these like they're like this golden or like rust color kind of um like satin yeah like a satin fabric pants and then it also um I think these were separate these they didn't come in a set so I had to purchase these separately and I also got like this um what do you call it like a spaghetti strap um like cami top also in the same color and it's um I got this in a size what size did I get this in a size large and I got the pants also in a size large so they definitely fit me oversized and this is definitely something to wear a bed because it is so see-through like I can see so through it so this is something that you can't go out the house with is I know some people like to go out in their loungewear you know or their PJs this is not something you want to go out in this is strictly for going to bed um, so yeah so I was super excited when I found this I don't know if it's still available as a matter of fact I don't know if the majority of these items are still available if they are I mean I'll link them down below anyway but you know if they're not available when you go on the site just hit the notify me when um, so that way you'll be notified when they come back in stock but I think these are good pieces and again they go all the way down to my ankle and just very nice and comfortable they're not too tight um, so I would say if you want it to just fit to get your normal size but if you want to have you know have it fit loose and just kind of flowy then I would size up so um, also um, if if any of these pajamas because they always are stocking up on pajamas so if I can find something similar I will link them down below because they always have pajamas or having you know different types so I will try to link some other pajamas down below so the next item I got is also some PJs and I love these I instantly put these in my cart when I saw I love polka dots and um, I saw this set and I just had to get it and it's just like this polka dot um, pajama set and they're like in this purple it's kind of coming off I don't know if it's coming off pink on camera but it's like a purplish kind of gray color kind of 
between purple and gray, I would say. And so I got the pants and I got these again in a size, I got these in a size large and like I said, they are a little bit oversized on me. So um, I like my pajamas to not just, I don't want them to just, just fit. I want them to have a little bit of room in them. So yeah, so I got the pajama bottoms and then it also came with the um, top and it's just like this button down kind of top same color and I got this again in a size large and yeah so I love these two pieces and like I said if I can't find these I will still link them but I will try to find you know and link something similar if these are out of stock all right and the last three pieces I got are coats so let me show you those all right so I got this um like it's supposed to be like a I don't know like a trench coat yeah, it's like a trench coat. And it's like um, this trench coat. And it's like in this kind of grayish, kind of grayish beige color, I would say. And I got this in a size large. And it is a rather, it is rather big on me. So I would say if you're looking for like a nice trench coat, it comes to like a, the perfect length on me. Like it's not too big. And, um, you know, or it's not too long. It's not too short. It's like the perfect length on me. And I got this, um, and it, like I said, a size large, and it's like in this gray color, and it has like the butt, the um, belt here, so you can, um, you know, belt it up if you need to. But I just thought it was a nice piece. It's very good quality, very substantial, and it's very, very heavy. Like not too heavy, but it is, it is pretty substantial. Like this is a good, this is a good piece, I would say. So yeah, if you're looking for a nice trench coat. Um, I think this would be a good one to get and yeah so that's the first coat that I got and then the next coat I got is another trench and this is more so like a hmm this is like a beigey kind of color and it's very long and very substantial and let's see I got this in a size extra large and it's it's way too big so I don't know why I got it extra large I think Probably, they probably didn't have my normal size. They probably didn't have a large or a medium. That's probably why I got an extra large. But this is huge on me. So I'm thinking I'm going to send this back because it is way too big. Like, I mean, I could layer a whole bunch of stuff in here, you know, under here. But it's just, yeah, it's just, it's just way too big. I don't know. I'm going to, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to think it over. But I do love, like, the detail. I can't, I don't know if you can see that. But it has, like, the button detail here which I just absolutely love that but the uh, button or not button but like the, the cuff on here I love that and yeah it's just a nice it's just a very nice coat it has like this kind of detail here it does look like a it looks like a Burberry trench is what it looks like so if you don't have Burberry money like you know most of us don't <laughs> then I think this will be a good alternative I mean it's super long so yeah, so y'all let me know what you think. Should I return this or, you know, keep it? Because like I said, I can always layer like big chunky, you know, um, sweaters underneath it, you know, and I'd have plenty of room. So, but yeah, so I would say get your normal size. If this is still available, I don't even know, I don't even know if it's still available, but I will link it down below if you are interested. All right, and the last piece I got is this jacket and it looks like this. It has like little pockets here. This is the jacket that I think that I think everybody has, especially on Instagram. Like every time I go on Instagram, everybody has this coat on or has this jacket on. I don't know. It's just very popular. But anyway, as, as rightfully so, because this is like wearing a coat. This is definitely not a jacket. This is to me a coat that looks like a jacket. That looks like it could be a shirt. Um, but it's in this again, this like um, beigey kind of color, and I like it because it's kind of like speckled. You can't, I don't know if you can see it from the camera, but it's kind of speckled. Um, and it has like these nice tortoise shell buttons here. So, yeah, I love this. I love this jacket and it's very big on me. I got it in a size medium. Um, and I'm normally a medium, so I would say this is definitely oversized. So, if you don't want it to be super oversized, I would say size down one size. But if you want it to just be just enough oversizedness, I guess, then, you know, just get your normal size. But this jacket's probably not even still available. So, yeah. Um, but I, like I said, I will link everything down below, even if it's not available. Just in case you want to, you know, 
hit that notify me button to be notified if these items come back in stock so but yeah so that is the last piece that i got all right guys so that is all the pieces that i picked up from h&m um i hope that i hope that these items are still available that's what i'm hoping because here lately it's been taking several weeks for me to get my items um or to get my orders from h&m um i you know i guess because of covid and whatnot they're taking extra precaution which I'm, i can appreciate but it's taking forever to get my items so yeah, and I have some, I've ordered some other items from H&M, so I don't tell them when I'll get them. I probably won't get them until after, probably till, not until the end of the November, I don't know. Um, hopefully not. Um, but yeah, so like I said, I will link everything down below. If it's not available, just hit the um, notify me button um, on the, on your size, and you'll be notified. It That worked for me. I had just purchased a uh, sweater dress and it was out of stock and I just hit notify me and they notified me when it came back in stock and I went immediately on the site when I got the email and I was able to get it so it does work so I, I can def definitely attest to the fact that pushing that notify me button when something comes back in stock um, they will notify you and if you're if you get on there in time that's the kicker you got to get on there in time um, you know you're, you may be able to get your item so um, but yeah, so that is all the items I got from H&M and also just wanted to remind you also from the, the jewelry pieces that I showed you from Ana Luisa, um, don't forget to check it out, if the site out, if you are interested in any of the pieces that I showed you or if you want to try out some of the pieces. Like I said, they're good Christmas gifts um, and they're having a Black Friday sale right now so you'll get some money off so can't go wrong with that. Some nice, sustainable, affordable pieces. Uh, for you know any occasion so alrighty so that is it that's enough rambling right so thank you guys so much for watching if you hadn't noticed I just got a new camera as well so I'm trying to work with the settings and with the lighting so just kind of give me a minute to kind of figure this thing out I just got a new camera so I'm trying to level up my camera game and the quality so just bear with me until I get this thing situated so all right so thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy this video and I will see you guys in my next video all right bye guys